Ah, I remember you. What brings you to the encampment? It is a miracle you're still alive. Though I dare say that's true of all of us. Oh? You believe we ought to evacuate? Well, you traveled far indeed to deliver these tidings. Farther, I dare say, than anyone would go for the sake of an idle jest. Hmm. If we must leave, we shall have to begin preparations at once. But I think we're a bit short on hands to attend to all that must be done. In fact, there's a rather delicate matter that I could use some help with. A blacksmith and his wife dwell on the encampment outskirts. Might you escort them here, so that they can join the evacuation? The smith, Gustava, is a man of good sense. But as for his wife, well, suffice to say, Cleuna has always been a contentious sort. She'd have naught to do with us, given the choice, and isn't likely to take kindly to the arrival of any of my knights on her doorstep. I can only hope that she will be more willing to listen to you, a third party, as to her. And while you're taking care of that, I will see to it that the incumbent is made ready to depart with all due haste. Ah, I remember the blacksmith and his lady wife well. I only hope we can convince them to join the evacuation. I quite agree. Would you be so kind as to escort the blacksmith and his wife here, so that they can join the evacuation? You'll find their home on the outskirts of the encampment. The smith's wife, Cleuna, would sooner have naught to do with us, and is apt to turn any of my knights away on sight. I can only hope she will be more willing to listen to you.